Hey, hello everyone and welcome back to the video demo 1000 day challenge the day and is really nice so let's get things started so i think mentioned that bitcoin is very likely to remain relatively flat and it is right now what it is remaining relatively flat although we do see some kind of rejection over here taking a closer look over here so we can see very clearly that we are seeing some sort of rejection of the 20 and 50 super moving average on daily chart so that's definitely likely a normal sign. In my opinion, nothing to be too significant about. And we can remain very close towards the trend line, at least for the next couple of days, until the very first of January itself, whereby this 50 simple moving average will likely also flatten out, in which case we could likely reach approximately the lows of the 16K, or even just right above the, yeah, right above here, which is like the 16.1K region itself. And even then, it's still very clearly to be consolidating based. Nothing much has changed. If you're looking in terms of four hour chart, similarly, like I mentioned, you do see very choppy signs itself. You're just hovering around this 200 simple moving average on the four hour chart as well. So, yeah, with that said, I'm definitely not looking to enter any trade right now, especially for Bitcoin. If you do want to enter any other trades, probably Altcoin would be much more suitable choice, especially if those coins that still remains to be volatile and there's still a specific sufficient volume to be traded. Otherwise, with that said, I don't have any much to say. So let's see how the market opens. And the last week itself, I don't expect much volatility, but of course that could also definitely change. But if volatility does change and we do see strong spike in either direction itself, then I'll be very keen to enter in the way. So you can see ESH and KREC definitely spiking, especially with the news that China is going to uh, stop the quarantine requirements starting from next year on the 8th of Jan. So that definitely does play a role if China market do open up, which is the world like second largest economy itself in terms of GDP wise. So that definitely will help if it actually does have a strong rebound. So people are actually starting to factor in play. And then with the fact that KBA has been significantly hit in the past one to two years, it's definitely is a very good time in the round time as well. But and then with that said, I come to the end of today. If you guys have any questions, feel free to drop out your comments below. I'll see you guys tomorrow. Take care. Bye-bye.